What's going on guys? This is Tyler, Clean Cut Lawns. Hope you're all doing well. If you haven't been to this channel before, consider hitting that subscribe button. If you don't mind, hit that thumbs up button for me as well. Um, it's something new I'm going to start on my channel. Hopefully if I can remember. And if you don't like it, then feel free to unsubscribe or not watch anymore. But I feel like I want to quote a, uh, a Bible verse before I start getting into my videos. But this one uh, means a lot to me. Um, this is Philippians 4:19, which says, "Sorry about the cars going by, but my God shall supply all your need according to His riches and glory by Christ Jesus." And I'm just going to quote a verse. If you want to know what it means to me, feel free to shoot me an email. It's down in the uh, in the description down below. But today I just want to do my lawn care trailer setup. Start with the blowers and sticks first, and of course I got a couple pieces that are missing. Um, from the video that I'll just briefly mention but starting over here first at the at the blowers well if I can figure out how to turn this around okay so here we have the echo PB 8010T the only difference between the H and the T is the handles on the tube instead of on the instead of or the throttles on the tube instead of on the side right here um, big old horse of a blower and I still have the BR700. You can see it looks uh, kind of rough. But still having it. It's still kicking. And then I have the, the BR800 with the, the standard pull rope. Standard pull cord on it. Um, I didn't want to spend the extra money on the, on the other blower. I have the Echo uh, PAS Pass Pro Attachment Series 2620 with the articulating hedge trimmers on the side. Um, I have the PE 2620 curve shaft stick edger um, the SRM 2620 weed eater string as you can see I lost the air filter and cover on a yard so I need to need to find that and this is the Shindawa T262 um, weed eater pretty much the only difference between these two is the color and the throttle you can see this throttle right here is in and this one is is not are covered and this one is not covered you know i used to not like that too much but uh now with these new weed eater racks that have come out it's not really much of a problem and then over here which you've never seen me run any stick husqvarna tools but got the husqvarna and this is the 525l and the reason i got it is because i've stopped in a store one day randomly and Husqvarna stuff was 20% off and it's hard to beat and this handle right here anti-vibration handle is very nice and it's a, a super light super light weed eater you can go ahead and get mad at me if you want to for calling them a weed eater and then this is new this year but I have the X mark commercial 30 inch push mower um, with the bagging unit has two blades on it very sweet mower if you want to see it in action let me know in the comments then we're running the right standard eye 36 inch mower very handy and then of course we got the the right standard x 52 and along with that you know we have the newer right standard x 52 which i left somewhere overnight closer to uh to where i work you know i have the ground logic cedar spreader um I have the what's it called ego I believe or yeah ego uh, combi system with the hedge trimmers and the pulse all this battery powered um, this pretty pretty sweet um, tool you know I'm still running the half ton f-150 with a 6x12 trailer and here's the question I wanted for you I wanted to ask you guys i'm getting a new trailer either 7x14 or 7x16 either with the high mesh sides the 24 inch mesh sides or enclosed so let me know down in the comments which one you would get and why um i think i have my mind made up but if you can convince me one way or the other then be my guest and feel free to try to um let's see what other equipment do i have that's not pictured all oh, the husqvarna 22 inch all wheel drive push mower and i'm hoping that this 30 inch is going to save a lot of time on those push mowing yards or you know some yards that i got a bag or 
those small yards to bag up the leaves or whatever the case may be but anyway i hope you enjoyed this uh lawn care video let me know down in the comments which trailer i should get let me know what kind of stick equipment you're using as you can tell i'm not too totally brand loyal i've been looking at getting one red max uh, weed eater string trimmer as well but um let me know what you're running and what you like about them i'm curious to know and let me know what kind of trailer you're running and i appreciate you watching hit that thumbs up and hit that subscribe button